Fala galera, beleza? Aqui quem fala é Arte, seja bem-vindos a mais um vídeo aqui no canal. E no vídeo de hoje são os melhores momentos dos jogos profissionais de CS. Eu sei que você curte, mas 70% das pessoas que assistem os vídeos aqui no canal todos os dias não são inscritos. É isso mesmo. Então, não se esquece, se inscreve aqui no canal, deixa o like. E lembrando que dá muito trabalho trazer todos os dias os melhores momentos, tudo mastigadinho pra você assistir. É bom, né? Então, deixa de enrolação, vamos ao que interessa, são os melhores momentos. Fui! way into this matchup. Well, I think they showed by the bounce back and look at what they did against Mouse. Look at what they did in the playoffs. They're here to win and they're here to succeed. And we're about to find out whether or not they are going to succeed. It is time for the grand finals of the Elisa Masters Espo Apex Furia. Seen some very slow T sides played over the course of this weekend. Apex want to make it a very careful affair here in the opening. Ah, uh, however, has a couple of plans. Two sets of pistols round the corner. Kakanito can get the first, and Jacob can follow it up. Look for the third man of the B bomb site defense. Art uh, is so low here. Apex have busted it open. They'll get the bomb plant. The wonderful entries there coming through from Apex. When you look at Furia, it seemed like the right idea to retake that calf control in there with a flash. Art uh, gets away with one, but overall, the entries have just been so damn successful before K Serato gets two on the retake. Okay, this just got interesting. Two versus two. No kits on either player as of right now. Kixan and Kakanito are backed up in their defensive lines. Are they going to get sussed out? Kixan will take a face and not quite hit the shot. Kakanito's P250 does one better. And now K Serato, he started up the return on this retake with his two kills. Needs to get two more. Running out of ammo in the end for Kixan. He does secure the kill. Of call. Kixan about to round this corner. He sees his contact. He gets his kill. Advantage tips back to evens but Fallen takes it right back for the Furious side. He's out in the open spraying manically with that gap and a smoke. Nort can train him but Art still stands on defense. Backup is yet to rotate. He has to do this on his lonesome. He gets just a bit of information but not enough ammo in the mag. Attack to the retake. How quickly can they make it in though? They haven't got a lot of time to play with. They have got time to catch off sense. That's one man down. Nork all alone. AK versus two. Backed up hearing all the footsteps. That's exactly where they're at but doesn't peek into the right man at the right time. And Yuri will close down the first round for Fury. Oh. Pressed up ahead of that utility basis. Sense is going to completely miss the man. We'll check position. Kixan's going to get caught off. Yuri has to swing to a secondary kill. He doesn't know, but yeah. And despite that, Art's going to come in with extra support. Yuri still gets the directive engagement. Dry face comes up good. Five on three. A very good assistance out there just with the utility from Boiler Jacob to try and press out here towards brackets because they're desperate. Ark gets a freebie. Oh, AK of Yuri, meanwhile, waiting for them to make their move again. Apex are prodding. Gonna let this time run really low. K Serato shut down by the Tech 9. Now, that's a huge kill, and it keeps falling out towards Bay. There's still a little bit of a lurk right now. Smokes at Moto. They're still indicating that's some eight. sort of A play, and yeah, you're right about that. He might rest all on Cello here. He has an AK in his hands. Sees the utility coming as well. Sees the first spray is awkward. He gets it together in the end, but Jacob overwhelms. It's an advantage for Apex this time as they crack open B again. Now sent set for the exit. Yuri does catch him off guard. Is this a way back in again? Oh, it very much could be. You think about the idea of nothing for them to play with on the Furious side except for time of that kit. Tapping and bursting through. Swing out. The AK of Jacob goes all over the place. The Orc misses as well. And now this can turn around between the Legends battle. Jacob needs to get involved. They're on the defuse right now. Have they got it in time? I don't think they have. It took too long on Furia. And Apex have another. The best that they can do on Apex is Ty. Jacob wants to get out of the release for the T side line, and Cello's not having it. A flash assist is just time to perfection. Cello could even be on for some more. Kakanito needs more assistance if he wants to make this duel possible. Cello backed up, spray through. Another kill, a double up. Sense now caught on his luck, but still finds the frag on Art. A ton of damage done to that Galil. There's no more AKs left in play for Apex. A kicks and trying to get the boost up out here towards the logs, but it's being heard. And Norg even gets spammed. Oh, oh, oh. What a round here from Cello. Oh my goodness. He he's, is hungry. He's got all the right reads. Sense. <laughs> no bomb control, no map control, no HP. Lacking in firepower. Cello still holding the angle because he wants the ace here and he might just get it with the way that Sense is playing in here. A cello. You'd imagine that it could just be happening. Sense out here towards bottom banana. Cello with the AK, and there it is. Gets the ace. Oh, he loves it. 
Graphics probably pointing at the kills. All five. Behind him, taps of the P2K ahead of the smokes. He's got a slight angle to play with that has just been disappearing. Right there, the smoke landed perfect. And the T's are making their way in. The Julie spam away for Jake, and we still can't get his star here. Kakanito backs up towards New Box. He's got T side players coming in from all positions. Cello looking for his backup man. Kicks down, does support Kakanito with one decent frag, but Fallen has turned it back to a four on three. Sense now comes in with the rotation, the bat line being caught off on Art's part. So it's another even man standing. Apex forced to pause. Okay, Serato actually get off of the bomb just because of that pressure from Sense towards Banana. Yuri is hunting for the next two main TT players, but Sense has got another kill. Fallen's down, so's Yuri. K Serato, one versus three, and the good Sense comes. Quickly kicks out on Maker's aggression into that banana control, spraying through the smokes. K Serato returns one better. Only damage can be done to the T side. Look at Art making his own individual plays. Sense is forced to fight out in the apartments. And they back against the position that they hold. And Cello, he still gets his double up. Now's the time for the young man to stand up. He's a just to pop up, hunting for info, hunting for their man. Smoke ahead, Sense now a known entity. It's going to come out to Nork, seeing what he can do from the corner. Fallen just barely checks him. Serato forced out on the TK. Eight seconds. Sense trying to make some noise, draw their attention away from the incoming rotations. They're going to get the kill for it, regardless. A two versus two on the retake. And they've got kits, but they don't have any util. Jacob coming in quickly out for brackets, and Kakanito catches one. So okay, Serato now up for the 3K. Engaging the first, and Kakanito's having none of it. Shutting it down, this all caught up in the apartments. He's lucky to be alive, but he doesn't stay alive forever. And certainly not for long. Cello opens it up. And now the pace just continues. Ah, uh, spam forward. Cello able to trade back on Kakanito. Nork is dealt with just as quickly. Furia advantage. Shake him! A headshot on four and a crispy one at that. The position, try to swap out to that AK, get the fire, higher firepower weapon. Jacob still caught his back up on the site. Tap burst, there's one, but not the second. Kicks down, SMG from range. Walk the walk. And what's he going to find? When's he going to find it? Kakanito gets shut down. Will that bait them in even more? The secondary peak of the secondary player gives Art a kill back. Sense is caught off guard as he tries to extend. And Furia just slowly reeling the Apex side. Picked them off piece by piece. He's are for the time being, but they are still closing in. They've still got points of position. He gets that one and another. So it's expensive for the T side, but the expense truly comes in against Apex. Once again, it's up to a 5-7 to try and dish out some damage. Two of them now as Kixan gets the position but he smoked off, does hear Art, he catches that one head shot, but surely will not get much more, and indeed he doesn't, Kakanito's USP far too low on the firepower basis to do much, they are running the time a little bit too low here, and Sense has still been undetected, keep your eyes on that minimap, that might be pivotal, oh, Yuri gets caught off, that bomb in the open, the USP tries to look for the man, Sense has escaped, and now the shots ring out, they're down to three players, same story for the CT forces, Plant will just about come in, oh, they've got Fallen, Yuri, he's all alone, he's overwhelmed, Apex have stolen one! I, I don't even know what to say. I, I, words cannot describe Comes that round. In towards long, another one down to the short control, one at the truck itself. There's one there for the broken wall. Sense flashed into the site, but Cello gets ahead of the game. Nork now holds his nervous. Kakanito struggles with his spray, doing so much damage. The Orpa forced out in the open, had no choice but to take a shot and pray. Kakanito now waiting for backup. He has arrived, but he still stands off against Furia. A cello's got a molly, and that's going to go right to his position. Doesn't quite land all the way, though. He's back behind the pillar. It hit the tip big box, tagged up. 23 seconds. Now kick sounds on site. Jacob's gone down. Bond can be planted without an opportunity to deny. And Art just mows through the last. A triple by is so much better. One rifle of Famas. One SMG on Jacob. That's the automatic extent. Nork. Holding alongside Kakanito, just a headshot comes in and the rifle has no vision. The nade to crack open the smoke, reveals everything they need to roll over the A-bomb site. Jacob's molotov off, he can catch Cello, but he'll get no more. Inferno falls apart at the seams for Apex. Burning up in the first map of the finals. Fury should take this at 13-9 and find a stellar start in the finals. It may have been a fallen performance that was fantastic in the first half, but the second half has been cello and art. And for Furia, there it is, 13 to nine. They'll be so happy about that one, Jay. What a performance. Ready to receive USPs on the crossfire. And Cello starting to make his prod in. One shot missed out. Next man to face. First to fall is on the T side. That's Apex with a start. And Yuri might actually start selling this and start getting some shelf control, start rotating that bomb over. Now Kakanito's got off passively and actually his teammates left him for a moment.
And an Orkin kicks down, also on that side defensive. Kakanito has gone down to the hands of Arts. Yuri presses forward and tries to lead the charge in for Furia. Again, time is of the essence for the T's. And now the CTs have rotated back up. Kickstand tapping up one head, looking for his second man, but he doesn't quite find it on Fallen. Now they're on the site. Tag ups again towards Jacob in the back. The plant can be secured though. And no map control here from Furia. Smoked off long, smoked off short. The only thing that they can maintain is ramp and cave. How do they get into this? No kit, no util. Apex just trying to prod forward for the dry faces. Art is ready for the first man as is fallen. Neither player gets the kill. Sense tagged up, goes for a directive engagement. First fire comes out. They get the one pick. Oh, the knife for Norg. Yuri takes it back. Can he hold it? Yes, he can. You can't start your way out of this one, boys. I just get faded. M falls across the Apex board. Utility in a standard. Case of Arto and Art were looking initially to try and see if they can split their way in towards that mid control. Art is going to get caught off for it. And here's your start for Sense. Now, Sense realizes he has to make a play just to try and get Jacob out of trouble. Kakanito getting close towards some of the spams. Is he going to aggress the line? He's thinking about it, but the smoke down instead. Blocks off Yuri from escape route. Now lane is controlled by oh, the CT on. side. I won't even know about it. Oh, Cello has actually snuck his way into the back. I don't even know if Apex are aware of this. Jacob is, yes. He deals with the next man. It's a five on three. Now Fallen's the next one up to charge the bomb on his back. Crossfire set here on A. Continuing to burst up. There comes a kill on Sense. Fallen dink down. Kicksan can remove him. And Jacob knows that it must be a second player close, but he can't hit the shot. K Serato returns one to the Apex side. The bomb is in the open. He's got no backup here. He's got to do this on his lonesome because the Lurk player of Yuri is challenging on that B play. K Serato goes down. So the Lurker is all that remains. How all towards mid that shaped up that entire round. And surely Yuri will not get Moe with much more than the exit frags at this point, and even that won't come towards him. Nork closes it down, and Apex face oh, Fury could find that trade. Art is hunting for it, but he's got no vision. At least he's got some support there from oh. Cello, but it's actually just a straight spam kill. Jacob gets away with one. I don't know how he's gotten away with that. Pure murder in mid. Now two facing kicks and has plenty of info to play with. Doesn't quite hit his spray together though. Next man up to face out over a cave. A flashbang will reveal himself. Fallen puts that plant down in the heart of cover. Kakanito trying to deny it, but the best he can do is tickle away at the HP bar. Oh, this late lurk is very late. And this is where Fallen needs to stay alive on the bomb side. There's nothing that this lurk can do. Round's over. Oh, it's so far away. On the lurk face back over at spawn. They're going to get to the defuse. I have no idea how Jacob's been able to get away with as much as he did in that one. He looked to face and didn't even get taken down at 3 HP. It's four up for Apex now. I think it's a pretty good response. Well, back into the thick of it. More important matters at the hand. Broken by, still here for Furia, despite the uh, issues that they face in terms of the economy game. They're still going to press forward with just as much vigor. Art finds sense. Edge of the smoke with a Mac 10. Guri follows suit on kicks and out towards this ramp position. Kakanito, good for the one frag. He's trying to try and block this bomb off from crossing. Fallen's forced to make the challenge, and he's going to make it happen as well. Nork and Jacob, two very different positions in a very difficult scenario. A spare of the moment. The mid pressure actually works out to be successful. Nork is trapped. He's hearing the footsteps of Fallen, but there's so many T-side players around. He at least might be able to drop the bomb out towards lane. No, it doesn't happen. Good shot there from Fallen. Impact from the veteran of the T-side. Sorry, a plenty over on Inferno. And then, of course, the Alyssa Invitational Summer of 2021. Beat everyone. All the way into the grand final, one and all. And that was when Honda was on the lineup. That's how much of a throwback it is. Oh. Throw back the casualty for Sensi. Turn 180. Jacob follows suit on case Serato through the smoke. And Yuri just giving a little bit of a shoulder to kick San. Disappointing in the last round, perhaps, but far better of a return from Apex. A five on two. And North with that big green. Already spotting the likes of Cello up there towards top ramps. The entry is good for one, but gets traded quickly. And shuts down Fordham with a quick swing. There's your boy, Nork. Counteraction utility there against the T side line who are going quickly into the B bomb site. Kicksand's ready against Cello, but not ready to adjust for the shot. The AWP in Nork caught that first. And look at Kakanito, suicide dive into the bomb site. He does get taken out for it. And Nork can't quite hit the secondary kill on the next man out from Ramp. Yuri crosses, fallen crosses, I should say. Yuri goes down next to the hands of Jacob's M4 and K Serato. Gage against Apex, who are similarly aggressive, trying to take the fight back to the Furious side. We're going very quick into this B site. Kicksand has 
caught one cello, did hold on to the trade, nor couldn't quite capitalize the shot, but Kakanito from behind the wood wall over at Cave secures cello's casualty, so it's down to three on Furia. And Nork is alone and could get flashed off here towards a long position, off angle being held. CTs are closing in the pincers as well, Furia might get sandwiched, the AWP still hunting for an angle, still hunting for a pick here, the scopes her, the smoke comes out to respond towards it, Fallen, Max a turn now, chance to swing for Jacob, he comes up against Caserato, Kakanito finds one more, Fallen on the bomb site, overwhelmed by the numbers game. Opening round of this map up, will it be the case for this one. Utility on the way, Art spotted it. USP to hold the forward contact from back line. Held Fallen's Julies can play offside position. Get a secondary pick on the centre. Try to look for Kakadito next to Nork and two kicks and just got nothing left in it. They'll spam him down. Fallen with three kills here. Nork has got no chance left. The cavalry's here. The backstab's in. The flash is keeping him blinded. And his time in this round is numbered. A fantastic round there from Furia. And what you maybe didn't notice there, Jay, just because of looking at that crossfire, you had Art big... Let me check it. Backstab from elbow, it's being watched. Oh, there's Sense catching Art. Is he wary of Fallen? The AWP. Hard scope. Okay, now they're aware. Sense checking positions, making his own footstep noisy. Is all oh, the spray goes arrive, and so does the AWP shot. And Sense secures it. Five on three. Execution inbound now. Kakanito and Nork clean house, and no one goes down for Apex. Lovely stuff from the youngster. No take from Apex. Fallen might now start to give a little bit of a footstep away. Let's try to bait them in a little bit close, which seems to be the call right here. Cello waits for his moment of strike, and all three converge. All five fall. Apex. Not done yet. A bit too deep, actually, so no vision for Art. The damage, though, to Jacob. Look at him, 55 to that HG. These have walked right into the beast. Oh, Yuri has no idea. He's getting caught with a temple bust. Straight to the head. Advantage, Apex. It's going to turn even further, or is it? K Serato cuts off the rotations. That bomb's the bomb not across. on the side. You're right about that. Is there a smoke to play with? I believe there might be. They're going to try to put it in, but Art oh, is hot on their heels. Oh, they're going to win it from the fight. K Serato stoned in by Jacob and Fallen still fighting in the back. Art oh, closing in the pincers, but Nork is so ready for this. Shot to connect and Fallen knows that it must be lights out on Ancients. What a walk. How's that happened? Open B site, Kakanito finds it all, and Nork's here to respond. And there it is, a closing up frag to make it a 13th round, a second map win for A. Furia go very quick into this T side start. And out of the A side seems to be the play. The smokes are in the way. The bomb is going to cross and get planted. Are there any names to try and deny it? Well, no. Kicks and just going to fall straight forward. Get the kill. Cello going down. First blood drawn. Jacob's not done here. Kicks that might drop or certainly fall. And Yuri will do so in return. Three now to the man advantage. Now two players up for Apex. Sense. Pressing on with the jewel, he's forced to get back out of position. Fury might have to apply the brakes for a moment. And this is what I think. Kakanito gets that kill, though, and Art is all that remains. Caught off, tagged up, taken down to the flank. I think the footsteps being heard, though, going to give the info. Checks out for Art, sprays a little bit awkward. He comes up with a casualty anyway. Such low HP meaning that K Serato can still hold back and get that kill back in. Sense, however, sacrifices HP to drop the bomb. He'll get sacrificed himself at the altar of Cello. A two on two ensues with 20 seconds remaining on Fury. The smoke will clear. Jacob's in the open. Oh, and they barely just get that kill together. Nork now alone sees the back player, and K Serato can lock in the headshot, recover the round for Fury. Well, look at that. Whoever wins Vertigo wins the best of five. Just off of the idea that Mirage is a strong map for both teams. Art finds sense through the smoke. Jacob losing another teammate in Kakanito on the other side of the map. Art, however, is a much more immediate concern. Nort gets credited with a kill. Jacob recognized he tagged up K Serato in the back. Damage up. Holds his nerve. Swing sees one. Sprays back forward. Utility sent, flashbang, catches Jake and blind, but similar story for the T side line. Nort comes up with his kill. Okay, Serato's finally gonna get dealt with, but he does take one with him. And Nort holds the he line. Jumps out here towards bottom ramp is saying absolutely nothing. And look at the space that Kickstand's taken. Fallen finds the opener though. Jacob's down, sends close against Startu, loses that fight. Low HP against two individuals now of the T side. Kakanita's gonna get one of them. Second man of Case Serato, where is he gonna get found? Fallen, seen through the smoke as Nork sprays back. Yeah, oh, catches Apex rather right in the face. There's your HE. 
There's your secondary incendiary. It does burn Case of Auto Cello does get that one pick though. Dinked up twice through the wall. Bang Yuri now needs to hold onto the bomb's position. Apex needs to get onto the bomb itself. The fuse being held with a smoke in the way. Man's been seen. Spray isn't quite there. Hit adjust towards North, but it is a hero else. Didn't actually extend. He's gone away without any damage whatsoever. Pressed on forward, seeing several. Now he's going to start to burn. And that one's a little bit better. Jacob caught out in the open, waiting for the fire to snuff itself out. A flash high, a swing wide, and a kill found for Cello. Nork now, his AWP forced back out of position. Sprayed down through the smoke by Caterato. And Kakanito, nothing that he can do left. What a take from Furia. And what I like about that, Jay, is and even that Flash that actually came through from the elevators, kicks in, tries to press and aggress without a teammate, gets caught there from Fallen. Sense takes Caserato elsewhere, though. I think he's known by Art, starting to creep it a little bit closer. There's the shot, there's the advantage back for Furia. Art might be low, but so is Sense. The high HP individual's been taken out. And, and this is really where Furia are at their best. When they're lurking in towards mid, when they're getting success out towards A, Yuri doesn't quite find that connection onto Kakanito, and now they can start shifting elsewhere. It's a three-on-three three scenario. Still so many players tagged up here. Orp set in the fall and Cello starting to make his move. Sense or this is a ballsy play and he gets taken back for it. Cello swinging out wide to the site trying to buy some breathing room for Furia or is he? He's just making noise. Oh, the ball's no. still there towards ramp. Sense starts leaning into it. Oh sorry, Nork I should say starts leaning into it and does get the kill. Two fallen. So wary of the bat line, so wary of the ramp play. The AWP, a shot misses. And now Apex have a chance. They have access to the bomb site. Fallen, holding his nerve. He sees one. Kakanito shuts down. Ah, oh, Fallen takes one back. Norks in a one on one with very little HP. No kits either. Taps that bomb and leaning in against this man. He sees him. Fallen just dives out of the way. AK recovered, but there's nothing left in it. There's no time. He'll get the kill. That's as far as it goes, though. Furia have equalized. My goodness, was that very chaotic? close up and out here towards the tarps. This looks very familiar to that round that Fallen had at Tree with the Jewelies. Oh, engagement there for Kei Serato. Jacob takes it right back. Kei Serato with a double up, looking for his triple. Wants his own pistol play. Wants a bit of revenge for what Nork did to them. But they're not going to get given that third kill. Art now in from mid. Spots the next, including the bomb carrier. Trying to take that fight. Is he aware of the player at CT? Absolutely not. Cello gets a frag and now looks for Nork next. Needs to prioritize that bomb position. Art's coming in as well. He's in a corner. He's got a fight. He needs that backup desperately and it's not going to come his way. Cello finds that next pick and Jacob left alone in the one on four. Yeah, they're not going to make sure that he doesn't get that plant down. Glock out from White, player seen at Jenny, player seen at default. This is such a difficult one to win. Backs up, there's one good shot. Ah, oh, down to the headshot tap, in fact. 40 seconds to play with. He's got to go deep into this bomb site though, and he knows it. A smoke in just to ensure there's no further press. At least to the right hand side, maybe in towards the crossfire on the left. Jacob. He's got to fight regardless, and he doesn't get past Kay Serato. There's your pistol for Furia. And Kay Serato, he's still with the HE that's now been used. A little bit early though, Bomb hasn't quite committed, no casualties taken. Nort comes up with two kills on Cello and Arts. Advantage now swings the way of Apex, and Nork's going in for more. A triple in the round. The danger Molly lined up there from Nork, and a boost up to the right hand side. Kakanito has been seen. Oh, what a shot that is. Oh, Damage oh. up on the next man, and Nork It's a five on three. On oh, Cello makes it two. Too low HP, it seems. AK is trying to swing in, trying to catch Cello in the back. Bomb needs to get planted here soon. They need to open up the angles. They can't see exactly where they're at, but Art's going to get caught. Cello, still unknown. Sense, here's the footsteps. Can't adjust. The Deagle shot doesn't connect it either. And kicks and trying to involve. Oh, one man's back is turned. They're starting to get a couple of casualties back their direction. But Sense is all alone as kicks and drops. A one on three with less than 30 HP. 5 7 spamming. There's one engagement. He gets tagged even lower. Three points of health in case of Arto. That's more than doable for him fighting to edge the other one out in the scoreline biding for that ninth which seems to go the way of fallen first and foremost Kakanito becomes his ninth kill of the game kicks in Trying to see if he can find a return. That nade on Yuri is pretty effective for the HP, but Fallen finds Jacob next. Again, the alley press is not there for the T side. For the utility down, Sense is going to get caught by Cello with his own aggressive face. Two left standing. Apex are getting picked apart by Furia. They try and fight back to no success at all. Kicks and.
just wondering how it all went so wrong. And it comes down to the man that's won it all, Fallen, has an incredible round. Boosted up out there at the alley, allows himself to multi-frag. Notice how he's even got the flash heavy out towards B. So, now these are B flashes, this is a pop. Might get caught up on a mid play. Okay, Serato does find one, but Kicksand does find that trade. Kakanito is indeed caught off guard. So, advantage is extended by Fury. A fallen Zorb holds the crack angle. Bomb has been dropped. Needs to get picked up, needs to get planted. It will be denied for the time being. And they need to hold off a two on four. Oh, this is so tough. Kicksand's gonna press. He's gonna get up towards the generators. He's gonna have fights from Guardian and CT coming in quick. We need something special right here and now. Nork. Checking positions, he might have to be the man. Kicks out his fall though. He swings for a headshot, a tight angle on Yuri. Oh, one no. player dropped! They missed the jump! Oh, fallen! You can't! Not now! Not now! Apex! Trying to make amends of his own accord. The AWP swinging in. Is he going to see anybody here? Nade damage. Oh, oh, he lined up so much right there. Catches the casualty. He's looking for the next. And Yuri provides support alongside Art. And they regain control. Apex. They've got 45 seconds. Got to think about that bomb part as well. Got to think about the post itself. Nork has caught Cello. Another kill isolated. They're aware of the AWP as well here. Tap burst to the M4. Yuri is stalling for as long as he can. Nork presses on, checks his corner. Got a turn 180 though. Where are the next two? It's a 2v2. Apex, can they recover this here? Time is short and they are trying to sell him on a fake or are they? The bomb's on its way. Nork's still looking for more here. They go back in for it. They've got to commit and they've got to go whole hog. All the info here for Fury. 10 seconds on the clock. Jump face. M4 has seen one. Nork charging into the hands of Fallen, who locks in the first and the second. True amends. It's Galil's. It seems like such a difficult prospect for Apex. Okay, Serato seen first. Burst not there. Spray against Sense. Not so much either. Nork tagged up heavy. Cello. Wanna focus, fire, he's also missing his shots. AWP now on the scene. Bomb should commit and plant. Nork is so close, the Fallen's not ready for it. I thought the flick was there, Nork snuck in one. Yuri with a trade back, the bomb's planted three on three. And Jacob's just gotta be the distraction, help out Sense for as long as possible. Art now on the ground floor, back lines held together. Flash sent, Art with a kill. He sheds with another swing back, another good kill to his own right. Kicksan has got to be the anchor player. He's caught next and Yuri lines them both up. Yuri, can he replicate successes? Kicks out, ready for it? Absolutely not. Advantage, Furia, Apex, continue on. Jacob revealing himself to the top of Ramp and backup is on the way. Flash is sent, adjustment is so far off the kilter. Cello with two, Kakinito and Norka the last two. Now just one, the most impressive one, but a 1v5 ace is not all possible. It's 13-9 for Furia as they take the advantage in the series now up by 2-1. Three days ago. Kakanito stands ready to receive them with a headshot. Can't quite hit the shots he needs. And Fallen will get the kill for it. First blood drawn out by Fury with a bomb plant and all. But very quickly, the CTs are making their way into the retake positions. They get shut down for it. Nor the next casualty. Sense will follow him to the grave. Jacob shouldn't be too far farther behind them because Kicksand's dropped as well. And he's all alone with the ace clutch. <laughs> this is just a shutout round. Stands ready to go. Molotov sent towards Nork's position. He might get forced out into the open. A flashbang catching him completely blinded and actually gets bailed out by Sense. Nork not knowing what's going on. Finally adjusts towards Cello. Looks back in for more, but Sense has caught his double and triple, in fact. A lot of impact from him in that last round out to the short. Oh, this is going to be another quick dive into B. HE is decently well placed against the second man. The first player is already out, and Sense has absolutely no idea. Cello's overwhelmed too. Kakinito can't even get a trade back. He's desperate for one, but none will come. Oh dear, Apex caught flat footed, switched off on defense. The third round for Furia starting to surge back into the lead. They're back up in control. Just when Apex thought they found their start. Also pressed aggressive. Who's going to see who first? 
Spokes will clear, fallen, catching a headshot. Kakanito considering a quick swing. Could line up two here, only gets the one. Art to fall, second player known. Third man also getting involved. Cello trying to force him back out. 22 seconds, Apex and Thunder Spanner into the works. Furia need to hit the site now. They will get sense. One to fall. Kakanito back behind the smoke. He's trying for blind sprays. Kicks out, meanwhile sprays back through wall bangs and gets nothing for his trouble. Another sick round from Kay Serato. We're keeping all of that impact and all of that emphasis and the guys coming up at top con. But what about out from ramp? That's where Kay Serato multis up. And they're out of there to save their guns one more time on Apex. Control. AK. Sat line and wait for some sort of aggression or just peek around the smoke. Similar story for Sense, except he's on the defensive line and over on the B side. Kakanito hearing footsteps. Tries to mow down the first, but R just transfers straight to the head. Kicks down. Can't catch one, but only one. Through the smoke, he actually doubles up. Cello's fallen, and now it's up to the B defenders. Three players on the way, one of which is creeping ever so slowly, and Fury gonna wait for his contact. Ah, oh, the quick scope of Nork. And now he's involved here, looking for a little bit more. Sense is his offside anchor. Looks in with a double, and the flick to the triple is missed for Kesa Rato will not last long against the M4. There's your answer. Pretty good, but Furia might not care about that. These two sat in the smoke, indicating they're going to go for a faster hit. And they're going to try and walk on a contact and Art gets caught. The second person has to back up. Now they need more utility if they want to commit again. Counter incendiary coming in from Kakanito, I think a little bit too late. It does actually deny them from the uh, Tetris position. Kicks out, has caught another good kill. Swinging back in for the double. Burns so heavily. Kakanito with another. And Cello is suddenly all alone. And finally, Apex have found their form. That's a very good response. And I think he could feel there for Furia. They wanted to... What? Oh. oh. He turned back. It's all a case of timing. Oh, we look back at the right moment. Kicks and forced to take the spray. But Art back in with a trade. Now Jacob on the scene. Both backs are turned. Both players spotted. Jacob looking to swing alongside. Kicks and he sacrifices himself for the AK. And now it's down to a two on two. Back up plan for Furia. Hit the B bomb site and Sense is going to hear them. The footsteps known. He's backed up passive, waiting for the tap, waiting for Fallen to make a mistake, but no, he just taps it for the bait. K Serato, low HP on the outskirts, the pre fire, oh, he's done damage, but his teammates fallen back, it's such low HP in the server, and K Serato can close. Notice that round, Jay. They know that Sense is backside. They know where he is. Towards window actually takes quite a bit of spam damage on the return. Kakanito down here at underpass gets that first kill onto Art. How much more can he find? Things better of a swing. He puts a smoke down. Sense gets the kill, but he's traded back by Yuri. Chance to try and see if Kakanito can get another good kill. He swings back, but Kesarato is much closer. He aimed for the player up top mid, and it's a 3v3 as a result. Or does he just wait? Does he wait for the backstab? It seems to be the case. Jacob ready for Kesarato. Locks in the spray. Now the author connects on Fallen. No missing here on this site. But where is the last? Yuri on for a clutch. Nork just backs off. He knows he's got the bomb dropped in the open. Yuri might take the kill for it, but the CT is going to adjust against Nor. Checks it and lands his double. This is a misread from Furia. They think that they've got the B side open. Apex have read this well. Cello's finally fallen, but it's coming as an early kill. It's a sacrifice for information. You're going to send them back into a cancel. No. Fallen. First man out has seen one. Spray through. AK involved towards short. Sends credited with the kill. Kakanito with a trade. Kicks him with another. Art responds back with the AWP, but the AK's not done. He might be done, though. Spray doesn't connect the full on casualty, and Art misses a shot. It's all Yuri now. Deagle in hand. One on three. 30 seconds to play with and it seems like it might not come together. Time ticking. Bomb on his back. But so much to deal with and Apex are giving him no breathing room. He'll tap desperately but no heads will come. Yuri just is not happening. Players out in the open finally do go down. Next player no. Drops in towards Jail but no flicks. Not against Sense. Six apiece. It felt like Furio were going to hold control. Can, can he press? Can he look for an opening fight in top mid? Swing of the USP. Slow walk. Sharp. J. Kuhn catches the goosh. Down at 15. He continues to fight because he's got no choice. Yuri's been forced to back up. Sends him from underpass. Gets his kill. K. Serato's running out of ammo. Ah, can get one pick back and kicks and will deal with him. Distraction there. Fallen's on low HP. And now he's dead. Cello. Can try and cut the bomb carrier off from position. He hears those footsteps. He's made his way in. And the tease is their danger here. There's one kill found. Second player inbound from short has got his next tag. And Jaken will secure the pistol for Apex. It just showed from Kay Serato as soon as off of the CT side. Unknown to the tease just yet. Instead, Art is Kakanito. 
draws him out. Kay Serata ready for the trade back, and that's exactly what he'll find. And this is the split in from A, and Kicksand catches an unreal timing. Picked up an orb for three turns, quick 180 on Kay Serato here. Second shot doesn't connect. And now he supports the A take. Only Yuri to defend against this spray goes everywhere, but to the casualty. Kicksand finally swings for his orb frag. And Kay Serato is in another clutch situation for Fury. A bomb has been planted. And his best bet is to run and hide. An incredible round for the in-game leader of Kixan. As well, so the damage might compound to a number of frags here. Jacob leans in, fallen, has been seen, caught off, damaged up. Oh, that's exactly what I was hoping wouldn't happen. Five on three, bombs been dropped. They can't back off, they have to commit here. And they've got a lot that's coming through from CT, but I actually think it's being held from Art. And the cut rotation is necessary. USP versus the AK. Kakanito baited. He does out some damage. He's going to give chase, though. He's going to stall for more time. Just keep him away from the real target, which is that B-bomb site here. 25 seconds. Kicksand, unawares of Yuri. Did just spot him there. The 5-7 versus the AK. He needs to get this kill in case Serato's caught another. Kakanito cuts off. Two left standing for Apex. Fury on the precipice of a steal as the headshots are landed. And Nort comes crashing down. No double digits for Apex, Furia. Scoped in watching. Here come the T's. Jacob shut down first. Yuri can't stick around in dark though. He's burning quite heavily. So kicks down with a kill, but Kesarara takes sense back from beyond the grave. A double kill comes in from that M4. He's such low HP, but so's fallen. Burning to 13 and 6 for Kesarato. Kicks down's also low, but Apex have a way into the sights. Yeah, they might just have to play retake. Cello has got to do a lot of the heavy lifting. Kicks and doesn't win the fight. Nork, now one on three. Nade sent his direction. One man makes his way in the AK. Spam pulls his attention the wrong way as Cello swings for the spray. That's what they will do, slowly but surely, pressing forward. As at the CT side, shots ringing out. Cello knows that kicks out slow, but somehow comes up with so much damage. The incendiary back in the opera, and Nork cannot respond. Out towards ladder. Oh, the timing actually works out for Art in the end. Out to the apartments. Nork might look for this orb. Jewel fall and catches him. And now it's all on to Nork. Incendiaried off. Bomb in the open. 30 seconds. And now Jacob will try act out. Shello hears it. AK engages real quick. And the orb has now here to cut them down. Kicks and first to fall. Orb shot does not connect on a second. But they continue with the push. Fast play out from Apex. They don't have time. Fallen. A flash involved. An orb to peek. And to check the window. Kakanito peeks right in. The orb of the seaside, however, comes out from short. Six seconds. Cello's caught the bomb carry. And Nork has got to save again. No choice in the matter, no time available. Furia have the 10th and the lead. And in Three a win rounds to get it. Apex need a step up right now. Fallen seen the first. Kakanito has fallen. Smokes off top con, repositions again. Apex are bringing a lot of players out towards mid. Break into the smoke, fallen might look again. Okay, Serato. Up on short, senses a wall away. The flash is sent to the man. Of course, we'll keep him blinded. He's fallen. Watching, yes, he is. Sends the drop. A five on the three now. Okay, Serato might even spot the bomb. Didn't go for the full swing, and now Fallen can adjust against that. Shot finally misses out. Nork trying to play as the second player. Okay, Serato catches kickstand. Jacob's traded, and Yuri closes out the last. 11 now for Fury. It's for the faster play. Cello, AK, set for the spray. It goes everywhere. Not to the casualty. He dies onto the bomb site and can deal with one. Jacob's overwhelmed up though. The clock has pulled out. He's got so much for it. The 5 7 has removed so many. K Serato finally overwhelmed by Kixan. He has another bomb with him. So does Kixan. Peek right into it. Gets shot down. You are not escaping with a steal on this occasion. It's fast. In from the CT side. Look at Cello with the confidence. He's got Kixan. In case Serato's caught Nork. Oh, it's all falling apart. Apex. Reduced so heavily. And nothing can be found on the A site. Kakanito with the impossible clutch. The impossible dream. This is a tough situation. He's still in the time. Checking every position. Finally see one! And Cello plays me a tune of victory! Good night, Apex, and good night, Espo! It's a three-to-one series to make themselves champions of the
nearly some Masters. And for Furia, this has got to be such a long time coming. Three years since we've seen them in an international grand final. And my goodness. better team was Furia. The better team, the better veteran was Fallen. And Espo, I want you please to make some noise for your champions. It's Furia! E aí, gostou dos melhores momentos de hoje? Não se esquece, as estatísticas estão aqui para você analisar. Pausa o vídeo caso você queira ver e acompanhar tudo certinho. Sua inscrição e seu like aqui embaixo é muito importante para a evolução do canal. Te vejo no próximo vídeo. Fui!